The entry to the Roman castra is through a reconstructed stone arch connected to portions of the rebuilt fortification wall. The paved street, called the Via Principalis, leads to the base headquarters building. On the way to the headquarters building, Principia in Latin, the panel alongside the street shows what the street would have looked like in antiquity, with a long line of colonnaded porticos on both sides of the roadway, a standard Roman street layout all over the empire. A statue of a Roman legionary soldier guards the entrance to the Principia courtyard. The lepidarium in the courtyard displays emperor statues and inscriptions recording buildings and altars in the camp and tombstones of soldiers from the Legio 13 Gemina garrison. The altar shown here is a good example of the rich epigraphic material archaeologists have recovered from the site. It records the dedication of a temple by a soldier from the legion. Inside of the Principia, the treasury of the legion has been reconstructed, down to the detail of the small white money bags with the soldiers' pay in silver denarii coins. Also stored here are the legionary standards for the 13th Gemina, the legion's most prized possessions never to be lost in battle. Elements of the Hippocost, the Roman under-the-floor radiant heating system, are visible in the nearby meeting hall. The modern assembly area has been inserted along the reconstructed portico with its row of partially preserved original columns of the Via Principalis. Daily life in the military base and its environs for the soldiers and their native families is interpreted in the scale models here in the preservation shelter.